Okay, guys. Time to do a follow up video on my thoughts on Peacemaker. And boy, oh boy. Boy, oh boy. Got bad news. He got nerfed. Ah, <laughs> uh, boy. He got nerfed. Uh, okay, so. In part one, I was talking about it. why I think Peacemaker is bad. Well. Bad compared to like the other characters, like with with a cameo, yeah, it helped him. It it, it increased like his position in the talus, like with him and with him and Skrykel or him and Kino. But like him as a character, I feel like he struggles so much because these characters have something that makes them easier to play with or makes them broken or whatever like katana was on in a mix up and like how with Jax or any other any other cameo like it, it helps her excel or whatever but her base kit is very solid so she don't have to try so hard because she get good buttons and blah 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 she get a she get a a, a low starter and xyz i don't even know to talk about melina she get everything she get a low she get a, a low start off and, and a mid but it ain't like a low star. It like yeah, it she could cancel off it, but it ain't a low starter. She have a she have a, a overhead she have a overhead combo star. Like like she gets some and she got good damage. Tanya she got the the block she not against with Goro. She also have a low. She got rain overhead low. So on overhead low. It's stupid mix up with Kong Lao, but it it can be harder because Kong Lao got nerfed. Overhead low plus command grab. Overhead low. Stupid character. L low tail. <laughs> like, Scorpion is just a scrub. Like, every game except for X, like, he just a scrubby character. Like, they need to. Like, this is the this, this is the, the character. This is the flagship character or whatever. Like, this character helps you all sell games. And he's so scrubby, boy. For some reason. Everybody saying reptile low tail, but I have I have problems dealing with him. Like a good player, I I struggle. Probably because I shot a poke his his uh his his uh, low screen, and I know like they could be punishing me off it, but I still like the poke it. That's just a skill issue, but yeah, yeah, he a little mid too, but he get the he get the low and he get overhead launcher. See, he get him, he get the same thing. She struggles a lot because she only have that low starter, but she do have the overhead special move, which is which is really a gimmick. But she struggles a lot too. I'm even gonna talk about him. Same thing with him. Johnny Crazy, Kong Lao, same thing, same thing, same thing, same thing, same thing, same thing, same thing. Even 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 Quan Chi have a flipped overhead starter on a low. He have multiple. And he get plenty buffs, and this dude also, even though he saw the low there too, but he, he he get the low starter, he get all type of stuff. But I feel like he struggles against Peacemaker a lot. And then I don't even want to talk about this, <laughs> but I hate this gal. But she is annoying. But she also have overhead low. So tell me why they bring out this goofball and this dude don't have no low or no overhead? Like that's so. Like like that job that job the character so much bro like that like that job the character so much and like and like fighting against any other character with him is feel like I have to try so hard especially how he get nerfed. I mean no I lie, not 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 every character, like certain characters like Baraka, oh I hate that. Kenshi, I hate that. Omni Man, I hate that too because like they just could uh microduct the hell of my strings. Which is a skill issue, but yeah, same thing. Quan Chi is is a there's a problem dealing with him now because he get that kick from full screen. It could punish the gunshots, it could punish eagerly. Like that's great. No, it can't punish it can punish eagerly. Yeah, if it whiff. No, no, it not can't punish eagerly, my bad. Ashura, same thing. No I lie, it, it, it ain't that hard because I could keep her out. It's on her out, but this gal bro flip. <laughs> Kong Lao, same thing. It's difficult fighting him. I ain't really fight no Malian uh, Lime yet. Difficult fighting him because space control. Difficult fighting him once he get in 
But once you zone them out, it's good. I ain't really fighting a reptile. Annoying. Difficult fighting it once once you get in, but it is the space folk. Same thing as him, difficult fighting. Difficult fighting this man anywhere on the screen. Like anywhere on the screen, it's difficult to fight him with Peacemaker. Like, especially if Kane out there too. Bro, it's difficult to fight him because he just could fly over the gunshot. He could teleport and punish the gunshot. Chip me out. Like, yeah, and that's my man. So, really difficult to fight him. I don't really fight no rain, but I think it's difficult for rain in this matchup. So yeah, can he get better projectiles and better zoning and he can keep rain out pokes wise. No, I think rain beat him in the pokes. I don't know. Annoying to fight. But Peacemaker sort of the advantage because of the, the shield. And like in the zoning department, Peacemaker beats him in the zoning department. But like close range, Peacemaker struggled because he get better pokes or whatever. But I feel like it's an even match between these two. Difficult to deal with. Once you get in, difficult to deal with. Same as all, difficult to deal with. Once you get Goro and, and, and a bar and, and like a staggers or whatever, difficult to deal with. Once you get in, not really. Once you get in, I like because Molina's like to run away and play like a certain game, and Peacemaker also like to play at a certain range as well. So once I don't feel like he's yeah, he struggles sort of like in the, in the poking department, but like I, I think like that's all, even matchup. Difficult to get in, bro. Once he in, it's hard to get him off you. But he struggles with the zoning a lot, so it's like leaning in shower favor. It's like slightly leaning in shower favor. Six four. Difficult to get in once she get in, or like once she's. Yeah, I feel like it's the same thing. Do like like uh, shower like same thing. She gets some good buttons when she get in, and then he gets he gets only with the he gets only with two, but like it's a mix. Like when I fight that Shang Tsung player, it was difficult because he know he knew Peacemaker, and like like he knew the character and he know like what to do. But majority of the Shang Tsung out there, they don't know what they're doing. They just want to so on. So with that knowledge, I feel like Shang Tsung does good with Peacemaker. So. So like, I feel like Peacemaker, he just, he ain't no S plus 10 or more for sure. He ain't A plus, he ain't B. I think he's like C-ish. Yeah. And now how they nerf Skryker as well. Bro, like, he just a terrible character now, nah, bro. Like, he really is. I mean, to me, he ever was slightly bad. I mean, he still got the combo potential, but like now, now they they really, they really, 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 really nerf your boy. Just don't combo no more. Like it just wasn't combo. Like it just wasn't combo no matter how much you you put the time in. It just wasn't combo. See, like why the hell is that way? Yeah, see, it just don't come no more. I don't know why would they do that. Like, like, why, why, why would they do that? Like, getting that hit confirm alone is hard for me to make it because you have the poke and then space it out. Because the stun slow as hell. So you have the poke and then space it out. And then you finally get hit confirmed. Now you gotta time the bomb correctly in order to, in order to, like, get it to come up. So why would you nerf that? Like, that's such a stupid nerf or whatever. Like, like that's such a good asset for the character, but y'all nerf it like that don't make no sense to me. Like you should let him keep that, in my opinion, and probably nerf eagerly. Like, 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 like the full screen thing, the double eagerly. Like probably nerf that and then nerf like his combo routes. Like I feel like he doesn't, he, he don't need all of. He don't. I feel like he don't need. Uh. I feel like he, he don't need all of these uh, extended launches or whatever. Even though it's a cost of a bar, I feel like he shouldn't be doing that. Like, 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 balance mode like that to be fair. But they should have kept this. Like, this where his big damage should have been. Like, reward you for getting hit in the first place and then canceling strike at the right time. Cause normal times in a match, like I forget to call and strike at the right time, and then I lost the hit or whatever, and then now my combo drop. In like as a as a 
are, like has a execution problem for me. So like I feel like why would y'all nerf that? That's such a stain on the character. But other than that, the character is still the same to be honest. But I feel like he gonna try extra hard now and try to hover a longer cooldown time. Like he takes he takes long to get he takes longer to get back. So yeah. So it's still you still could do you still could do like certain things with Skyco. You still could do the torpedo and keep it safe. Like twice and keep it safe. Then run away. Put your shield on. Wait, see how long it's taking for him to come back. By the time he come back, someone already gonna rush you down now. So yeah, with even like, like that too, like that sucks, really and truly. So look, like, Kino really might be the best cameo for for peacemaker now for sure. Even though this don't even come no more. But yeah, look, like, Kino might be the, the best cameo for striker now. Just like. Oh, they nerfed Kano too. Took, takes Kano a little longer to get back. Too. Wow. 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 This character really. Dang. They really did this character in. All the things that this character really needed, they really did this character in. In my opinion. Because, like, no harder just to get, the, like, especially at a good level, no harder just to get. Hit by the slow ass mid like 19 frames like this like this shit hard to get hit by and then this too like people so disrespectful they'll, they'll poke you all day so you have to like do space control or whatever but some people they could see that you back dash and then block and then react currently now what do you what do you supposed to get off that <sighs> like that's so bad how they they nerfed that and they let that combo like that should have stayed and that should have been like your main damage combo route or whatever like reward the player for getting hit confirmed and then remembering to cancel into the cameo i understand if kino couldn't do it because kino was easier to because kino was easier to combo with in in neutral or whatever so i understand if kino couldn't uh combo up it then then that makes sense and just pick kino to be safe on the majority of things just pick kino to be safe then that makes sense but after you get the hit and then you remember to call striker at the right time i feel like if they keep that in that would have been a that would have been better damage for the character because then you get it rewarded for remembering the combo of that so that's just my thoughts on that but other than that other than that the character still solid or whatever he's still he's still he's still viable he's still gonna have fun with the character like he ain't outright bad he just he's just someone you gotta really you gotta really 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 play hard with or whatever because like other characters just they don't have to struggle at all like they just can hit you with a low hit you with over there and i get you second guess and run up and grab he don't have that he can't he, he can't just he can't just skip neutral and walk up and hit you with over there skip neutral and walk and hit you with a hit you with a double hit and low skip neutral and hit you with a triple hit and low like he don't even have that or, or, or quadruple not a, yeah quadruple quintuple hit and low like he don't have that bro that's that's what makes him suck at as a character because this game is so filled with crazy shit. Like he needs some crazy shit or whatever. In my opinion, to be great, I don't think we see him evil. I don't think he he'll, he'll like help someone place an evil, but he's still a good character. Like he get good anti zoning tools or whatever. He's still a good character. So I wouldn't I wouldn't really knock him and say and say oh. It can't make him work because it could make him work. They just gotta try really hard compared to the other characters or whatever. Like you really gotta try. In my opinion, like Kong Lao just Kong Lao just chilling in neutral and then he hit you with he hit you with an armor launcher into Goro and then boom full combo. Liu Kang chilling in neutral and he hit you with a double dragon. Now he rush you down and he hit you with the forward advancing mid. Then he gonna grab you and then 
Kong Lao, extend the combo. Can't see someone in Sento, you fucked. Blocking for your whole life, 50 50, you're dead. This gal doing whatever the fuck she want. Flying and grabbing overhead low, overhead low. Like, make sure for this. This fool, oh my god, my original man. Bro, he gets such a hole in my hand. Screen. And I love it. <laughs> that mid into low, like, bro, I hate that. But that's so great. That That is so great. Like, bro. And then he get an overhead launcher, but, like, that's what this character need. And then this fool, he get mixed. He get mixed with this. Especially if you set up the Kong Lao Hot or whatever, that low overhead. Crazy. And then this fool get all type of buffs. This fool get overhead low, too. Like, like he needs so much more in order to be crazy in my eyes. But I still love the character. I still enjoy the character. I still love, I still have fun with the character. I still making videos and playing online matches with the character or whatever. Despite making this video and saying that I still think that he's bad and he needs buffs. I don't know why they nerfed this dude, but yeah, nerf Striker, but you shouldn't have nerfed. The fact that he could combo off that or whatever. I feel like they should have kept that in, in my opinion. Oh, like that is so dumb what they did. But other than that, other than that, he's still a very fun character. I love to say eagerly. I love to do torpedo. I love to catch an opponent off guard and hit him with the torpedo. And then I love to, uh, to do the, ant the shield and then zone in. Making the person jump in, even though I'm terrible at anti-airing, but he so suck at at defense. But like once you in the blender, you then can't even poke. You like he don't even have a fast mid to deal with pokes, bro. Like he is so frustrating to play. I have to cancel into a special move all the time to get the, the opponent off me. Majority of the time, or they just get disrespect me and poke poke all day. And he ain't fast enough to like backdash after the first poke or whatever or just a execution issue for me but yeah but like he struggles so much but like he struggles so much especially with this side like the right side he struggles so much with the, against the right side in my opinion because like all of these heavy hitters that that have overhead low mix-ups in this screen like like come on bro except for Havoc Havoc is trash really but other than that and then the middle tier too, like he struggles with. And then, like, come on, bro. Like, why would they do that? But it is what it is. Just the day game and yeah. But if you like the video, make sure to like, subscribe, and comment. Let me know how y'all feel. If y'all feel like I just whining and I'm a hater or whatever, let me know. But yeah, enjoy it.